Hey guys. <laughs> How was part one? Fine, right? You know, after answering 50 questions, I'm so hungry. You know, talking really burns calories. I'm having the Chinese bread called Gai Mei Bao. It's a very buttery, sweet coconut taste. Anyway, moving on. So the next 50 questions, here we go. What are some things you do when things get tough? When you are troubled and worried other than prayer? Mm, I would talk to friends, or ask family for opinion. It's really important to have people share the load with you because we're human, duh. I would say the best thing is really ask God pray. But sometimes you really need help from people to give you advice, to help you. And you never know how your friends could help you. Really a lot. And family. During a handshake session, what would you do if fans do not let go of your hand? No, usually, um, I don't know. I don't have to do anything. I'm like, <laughs> the security or the staff would come and just like, let him go. I know they're happy to grab me, but I mean, grabbing me is my hands are fine, but grabbing me. But like, sometimes it's painful. You're surprised because some girls, wow. <laughs> no, I still have to smile. So I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> As someone in the limelight, how do you deal with criticisms or rumors by the media? The best thing is try not to read them. But for me, I mean, as an artist, I would say that I know that I cannot satisfy everybody in the world. There will always be haters and people who don't like me or criticize me. But I think some criticism is good because I could read it and I could learn from it. Like some of my fans, they would give me advice like, Sandra, why not next time you should try to blah 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 blah. And I appreciate it. But some people are just, ah. And trust me, people could really say bad things. But I would just, you know, shake it off. Like what Taylor Swift say, just shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it off. And rumors by the media, not them. I mean, people talk crap anyway. Let them talk. I guess that's a, being an entertainer. One of the ways to entertain people is to be the victim of them to talk. Which country do you love visiting the most? I don't know. I can't choose. Really, I can't choose. Every country is unique in their own way. And fans are all different. And I would say, depending on my mood, it's like going to holiday. Where do I like to go most? Anywhere, really. One that I specifically love. Why don't you ask me which one I don't like? I just hate taking long flights because you get really back in. Uh, can you give me some tips for studying abroad in Korea? Hmm, there's no tips. You just come and learn. I would say you better ask your school carefully about everything. For example, housing, curriculum, and documents you need. It would be good if you know Korean, but you're going to learn here anyway. So yeah, there is no really one tip. Follow the flow. Be extrovert. Ask people questions when you don't know. Don't be shy. And don't be shocked about culture shock. Will you do an official meetup when you come to Singapore again? Like a lunch meetup? Your treat? My treat? <laughs> um, why not? I treat oh, me? No money, yo. I would like to do an official meetup. If I treat, then I think I have to start selling my books, my clothes, my body parts, and. Yeah. Resolutions for 2015. I think I have to get back to the showbiz more because I think for 2014 I really spent too much effort in school. It's good. I mean, I even got a academic scholarship, which means I really studied hard and I got good grades, so I got scholarships. So I think it really paid off for my effort. But I think it's about time to also work hard for the showbiz. And my company also like, Alex, don't you think you're studying too hard? Don't you want to work? <laughs> What's the best way to mend a broken heart? Time is the best way. I mean, what else can you do? Being with friends will help. And keeping yourself busy will help. Comfort will help. But these are just things that will help. The best way to mend it is really you yourself, your own will, psychological strength. It's all in you. You have to be strong and time will be the best thing. Time is the best medicine. And please, broken heart doesn't mean the end of the world. So don't be like so crazy and don't regret doing stupid stuff when you have a broken heart. It's not the end of the world. Would you eat a bowl of edible crickets for 10,000? 
ten thousand won. Ten thousand won is like ten dollar US doll. I won't. It's ten thousand US. Why not? Crickets, edible. They might be yummy. Duh, I'm partly Chinese. I eat everything. <laughs> How are Singapore fans like? Singapore fans very Singaporean. Wow, no? well, wow, so shock. What do you want to receive on Christmas Day? All I want for Christmas is you. <laughs> Um, hey Sander, how's life? <laughs> life is good. <laughs> Thank you. Life is good. Life is full of surprise. Life is fun. C'est la vie. Is it true that you are mixed with Filipino blood? Oh yeah. Why? Because Wikipedia did not include it? Yeah, I have a bit of everything. <laughs> I'm a pat bingsu, ice kachang, hello hello, bibimbap. What do you think of your fans? My fans, people say fans are like their artists. You guys are so wonderful, like me. <laughs> I'm really proud of you guys because there is something different about you guys. You guys are very deep, not just like fans, fans, like, <laughs> but really, you guys think and you guys are really nice. I feel like sometimes you guys are like my friends, my family. What kind of food do you like to cook? Ramyeon, mashed potato, steak, steak and mashed potato. God, I wish I could cook for you. Maybe one day. How do you become a Christian? How did I become a Christian? It's random. My dad was Catholic. He changed into Buddhism. Tried so many different religions. At the end, our family went to church. I don't know how to explain it. All of a sudden, you'll be like, oh, it's different. It was random. It's just, and oh. And then I start going to church a lot and trying to know more about Christianity, about God, the words of God, the Bible. And that's how I became a Christian. I baptized in when? 2002 with a group of Macau teenagers in the Macau Korean church. And if you had to sum up your career in one word, what would that be? Crazy! crazy. <laughs> My career is crazy. Best experience, lots of extreme up and down, best memories, suffering, joy, pain. Wow, just crazy. Crazy. Hello there, why are you so handsome? <laughs> I know, right? That's just a mean girl thing. Oh, mean girl is so good. You girls should watch it. Please don't be a plastic. I don't like plastics. Why am I so handsome? Thank God. Thanks, my parents. How were you able to survive four final exams in one day? I, I died. died. I almost cried. Really. It was like three days before exam. I was like, okay, fine, it's fine. And then later, there were twice. I was like, I almost really wanted to cry because I'm like, I can't do it. I can't. I can't do it. And then I say, I have to do it. And one thing, I have to confess, I gave myself the stress because I always wanted an A. For every subject if you're not chasing for an a a plus it won't be that difficult if you're just like oh c is fine just get a passing grade then three exam is not really that bad as long as you listen to lectures but some subjects even if you listen well in class take notes <sighs> It's still hard, so... Yeah, I survived. I don't know, I just studied hard. I did the best, the best I could. I mean, you won't die getting bad grades. It's not about life, but when you have the will, don't give it, just do your best until you can't and then just go for the exam and you'll be very dizzy <laughs> Study in advance, that's the best thing. I had so many projects. Anyway, I survived. Yes! If you could go back in time, which era would you go and why? I don't know. I don't want to go back. Every time has its own meaning, so I don't really want to go back. Did you watch the movie About Time? Watch it. It's about going back to times you could change. And if you watch the movie, you will understand. If you change something or when you go back, the meaning is different. But if I could go back to randomness in time, I would say primary six, second before secondary school should be year six yeah that was really stress-free i wasn't good at studying back then but my friends just before puberty there are no puberty drama no jealousy just pure eating going to school cartoons family so easy life no need to worry about money finance future yeah. Do you watch Game of Thrones? No, I heard it's really good. I heard people keep dying. I should watch. Do you stalk your fans? No, I don't stalk, but sometimes when you guys post something weird, sometimes I do click into that person's Twitter and see if- You better watch out. You better not bounce. No, I don't stalk fans. Maybe I should start stalking fans. Would you rather have a lot of grape-sized watermelons or one watermelon-sized grape? Grape-sized watermelon. It's easier to handle. Not really. What about the seeds? If one watermelon, one seed, two. Oh, why do you even think of this question? Why? 
Is that a psychological game? Question? Anyway, but I would prefer grape sized watermelon because you could keep it well and it's easier to eat. Imagine a big grape. If Arobo and Halo Halo are thrown in the river, who will you save first? None, it's in the river, duh. But if you have if you ask me to choose, of course I would save Halo Halo. Yay! What are the things your crazy end of semester celebration must include? Gathering with my classmates, having a drink, I think that will be the best thing. Because the whole semester, especially towards the end, you can't really go out, everybody's busy with group projects, essay writing, exams. So the best thing is, after you're done, everybody let's go and YOLO! You only live once. You know, oh my god, chicken, chimac. What would you name your future child? If it's a girl, Victoria, I guess, in memory of my sister. It's a royal name, queen. If it's a guy name, I don't know. Alexander? <laughs> no, one is good enough. Alejandro? Like my grandfather? I don't know, really. It depends on who my wife is. What would you rather keep as a pet? A poisonous steak or a really, really angry lion? So it's like, either way you're gonna die, huh? I think lion. I hate reptiles and snakes. Oh. <laughs> lion. Angry Lion. Can you rap or release a song in Cantonese for all your Hong Kong fans? It's really not up to me. Maybe if I sign with a Hong Kong agency, or maybe if a lot of Hong Kong fans want me to do. But for the time being, okay, lot of Hong Kong can you tell us any fans that left a lasting impression of you? A good one or a bad one? I would say it would be during my after I left you kiss, my first fan meet in Hong Kong. I think that was the best memory because I see support. It's really emotional. The fans were too. If you were to compose a song, what title would you give to it? Depending on what song, trust me. I'm probably gonna make a really weird title of me. What are your plans after graduating university? Will you still be a celebrity or pursue something else? Good question. That I don't, I don't know too. Like show business really random. It doesn't come to an end, just end and end. Once you're an entertainer, you are forever, I believe. So I would say it depends. If I'm really tired of it, I might prefer doing maybe like events planning, public relationships, hotelier, like my sister. You know? Or maybe I could do both. Why not? Both. You could still be an entertainer while working and doing something else. Why not? Don't limit yourself, never limit yourself. What kind of video games do you prefer? I love Resident Evil and those kind, you know? I know, sorry, it's really bad. I like Super Mario too. Super Mario Party. But I prefer something that's really, you know, Resident Evil, Silent Hill, that you could control. It's more real. Is it real? Yeah. But I'm a big fan of Resident Evil game. And I like Resident Evil 1, 2, 3. The best classic. Afterwards, it's good. I mean, 5 is good. 4 or 5, but I assume it's a classic. If you're Resident Evil fans, let me know. Pokemon. Oh my god. I bought my NDS, Nintendo 3DS. Oh, the new Pokemon. I'm not playing it because school. Why are you so perfect? Wanna be my boyfriend? Huh? You really think I'm perfect? No one is perfect in this world. Me? You just don't know me well. Maybe if I were your boyfriend, you'd be so sick and tired of me and you'd be like, Oh, Opa, you got so many flaws and problems. Can you bear me? If yes, then why not? What are some of your favorite Bible verses? I don't know the exact Bible verse, but I like few of them. For example, God never gives you things beyond your limit. So it just reminds me that whenever you have any hard time in your life, nothing is beyond your limit. The other one is like, though I walk through the valley of death, blah, 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 blah. That one also like that, because why do you have to fear? God is with you. What are your plans for 2015? Wasn't there a similar question earlier? My plans for 2015... I have to work, I believe. I have to. And my company has planned. So 2015, probably I will work. I wish I could work more because I think 14, I really did not expose too much in the media. So it's time for me to come out again. But I still want to continue my studies, so it's hard to adjust. Let's see follow the flow. If you were to open a business, what would it be and why? I really wish I could either have my own restaurant or bar food business. Somewhere that we could just hang out. Can I have a Christmas date with you this year? Calm. Bye! Christmas is over. Please try again next year. Pepsi or Coca-Cola? Both are Coke. What is the craziest thing you have ever eaten? Cow penis? When I was in America, I was having a Vietnamese pho and I saw a bisected penis 
sliced. <laughs> it was good. No, it was really good. It was really good. It's yummy. It's just like other tendons. Do you have plans on going to Europe? Bonjour, I'm in France. Comment allez-vous? <laughs> Where's my bucket and for you? <laughs> oh yeah, I want to. Me and my friends would want to. We wanna just backpack and go. But the problem is, dun opsoyo, no money, so expensive. Bro. Let me save money and go out. I'll let you know when I go. Maybe we could have a meal together. How many years did it take you to learn all seven languages? The problem is I don't, I haven't mastered in this seven languages. It took me my whole lifetime. I mean, though I'm still here, I'm still learning. I haven't mastered everything yet. I just enjoy learning. But one thing I can tell you for sure, if you don't use it, you naturally forget it. So keep using the language. What is your favorite ice cream? Uh, ice cream. Ice cream flavor. Rocky Road. Dryest Rocky Road. Or any Ube ice cream. Yeah, I think Rocky Road is the best flavor. I just like it, you know? Marshmallow, almond nuts, chocolate, rich flavor. Oh my gosh. What comes immediately in your mind when you hear strawberry cheesecake? Strawberry cheesecake. Is there a hairstyle you would like to try but never got the chance to? Mm -hmm. No, I don't think so. I think I tried a lot of weird hairstyle already from my, from my debut. Maybe long hair? But I'm gonna look old if I have long hair. Some guys look good with long hair, but... Me? I don't know. Either I look like a drag queen or like an old Ajuma. I don't know. Have you realized you have such a nice butt? How do you even know? Do I? I don't know I have a nice butt. Thank you. Do I have a nice butt? I don't think so. I should squat more to get a bubble butt. Bubble butt. Bubble 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 butt. If you have your own entertainment company, what kind of groups would you produce? International group? Because I like international stuff. I love globalization. I don't know. I would, oh maybe, it will be either young groups or American style, very open. No, that's gonna get me into trouble because Korean media is so conservative. What do you wish to do with Sanderettes if you have one whole day with them? A lot of things. Sports day, barbecue, watch a movie, sleepover, camping. We should do that. My bucket list, definitely. When will you start replying fans on Twitter? Mm, I don't want to because it's not fair if I reply some, some will be angry. Like, oh, but why don't you reply me? I hate you. <gasps> so, if possible, I don't really want to reply. Next question. Do you want to build a snowman? <laughs> No. There is no snow here, so you cannot build a snowman here. We need your help. Would you rather dress and do your own hair or be styled by someone else? It depends. When a stylist is good, I love when they style me. But when they're bad, sometimes I really wish I'd do my own thing. Especially hair. Oh my gosh. Some people really just mess my hair and make my hair like... <sighs> you guys know what I mean. What do you think of dating short girls? For example, 150 cm. I'm gonna have a backache, but why not? Height doesn't matter. Love is love. I'm like thinking, every time we kiss, we have to be like... <laughs> <laughs> do you sometimes miss being more active as a solo artist or are you content with the way things are now? I think both have good side and bad side. When I'm a solo artist, I wish I could just go to school and be like myself now. And when I'm like this now, I wish I could go back to work, which I actually have to. It's not up to me. But yeah, it depends. What are your favorite places in Macau and Hong Kong? What are your favorite places? My home. I don't really know much about Hong Kong because I grew up here in Macau. But if Macau, I like the lake. In Chinese, we say La Man because that's one of the places I always like to sit down and be quiet. And the signature of Macau, the ruins of St. Paul, the burnt down church. That's one of the places I like. It's so nice at night. You should go and see. Sanda 오빠에게는 혹시 Christmas 관한 특별한 기억이 있으신가요? Do you have any special memory about Christmas? Christmas in Singapore. There was a family gathering in Singapore. That was a hot Christmas. <laughs> so yeah, it was quite special. And it was a good time because all my family gathering. Do I have to answer in Korean? Singapore is it there? Yeah, no tours. Well, they Christmas and chuk channel. But they Singapore in some tours, nika. And you can't go in with nika. Some chuk chuk. Yes, me da. How do you ace your studies and assignments? 
really pay attention on cl in class. Ask your instructors about specific instructions or like things that the professor wants. As long as you follow everything what the professor does, what they want, the requirements, you should be fine, isn't it? And don't be lazy. You have to work hard. If you can choose to be a character in any fiction books, who would it be and why? Harry Potter? Hunger Games? Oh, no, Hunger Games. That's so sad. I'm gonna see my friends kill each other. Or maybe I could be Golem from Lord of the Rings. <sighs> my precious Have you ever believed in Santa? Of course, my parents, duh. When I was a kid, I don't know how presents would suddenly appear under my Christmas tree. I saw mommy kissing Santa Claus. That's a big hint. I even believe in Tooth Fairy. <laughs> how naive. I think you'll look cute as Aladdin's genie in movie. What do you think? Will you accept that role if ever? I'm a genie in the bottle, baby. Um, why not? Well, but if I have to be genie, doesn't mean I have to be fat enough. Because usually genie is like more Jenny. Why did I say Jenny? Hey, Jenny. My name is Jenny. I think genie should be like more chubby. Do I have to be blue? Like the Disney one? No, I think I will look more like Avatar. But why not? Yeah. Is it possible for you to stop being so attractive? It's very distracting. I was born, I was this, born way. this way. Is it distracting? It's good to be distracted sometimes. Dear Sander, are you still a durian lover? I still love durian, but I kind of... It's less than before because I don't know why people say maybe it's too heaty. But every time I eat durian, I get sick. So yeah, I kind of... These days I'm more into coconut. Young coconut. I love the coconut water, the juice, and then scrubbing up the coconut meat. If you had to pick one outfit Lady Gaga has worn, what would it be? Definitely the meat dress. <laughs> so I could just... I'm hungry. Do you prefer Twitter or Instagram? I like Twitter because I have more followers than Instagram. <laughs> but I like Instagram because I could make short videos and I could write a lot. No limits. I like both. Choose one. Be my best friend or be my boyfriend. Best friend. Oh, Don't be sad. Best friend because best friend can develop as boyfriend. You never know. But boyfriend, once you're separate, it's possible but it's quite hard to be good friends again. It's the other way around too. I don't know, I would prefer best friend for the time being. What Christmas gift would you want to share to your fans? Food. Food is the best thing. I wish we could just have a buffet together and enjoy all the favorite foods we have. <coughs> Yummy. Oh! Oh my god, I didn't know it's already more than 50. I'm already in my hundred and where am I now? Okay, I got lost count about how many questions there are, but I'll just continue and do it. 